Hello, everybody. Welcome to Cycle. This game is a generic, I guess, PT based off the PT game. And it is going to be a blast. Let's get into it. Are you sure? Yes. <sighs> Interesting. We're going in. It's like a pixeled way, though. It's like a pixeled PT. It's nice. Oh, the vase. Nice pictures. Creepy a little bit. Got another door. It's locked. Some lights. Oh, weird. Huh. Oh, and then we have the main hallway here. Main door. Some green stuff on the table. What the heck is that? What the? Some pills. Some photos. Huh. Let's go. What's that? What was... It was like a... Huh. That's some creepy noise. No one's outside. Alright. Interesting. The radio's off. What was that? Something. There's like a banging going on. What the heck? That's weird. It's like a... is that hey get out of my house damn goddamn squatters you get out of my house now can I have this candle get out of my house hey Oh, it's dark back there now. Get out of here. Get. Scram. I want to check this door real quick. Okay, can't still open that. All right. Let's go. Powering up. Fuck you, little bitch. Oh. Whoa. I got bugs all over me. I'm in a chair. Holy crap. Oh. Oh. Let me in. Okay. Same thing. Okie dokie. Um. Alright. Oh. 
Oh, there's now bugs in this area. Oh. They had to change it because of copyright, so obviously, because that door would be... Some of this is not... Oh, that's... That's the... Uh, great. You moved the candle. Uh, uh, okay. You can keep the candle. I won't touch it. Oh. Uh, hello? Uh, hello? Oh. Hello? What a nice room you have here. Hey. Oh my goodness. Hey! Get out of my house! I know you're over there. I see your shadow on the wall. I'm not stupid. I'm just checking out the room. Oh. It's kind of hard to read. I, Dr. Mark Pickley, declare the patient John Rubric able to resume their normal life follow, following the treatment and weekly follow-up. The patient was diagnosed two years ago with dual personality. One of them being aggressive and violent after treatment with with Thorzine and Sorrentil. The patient showed showed improvements in his self-control. Therefore, I declare the patient mentioned above is able to return to his home. All right. You, sir. Get out of my house. Your shadow's right there. I'm not dumb. Hey. I understand. But this is my home. Hey. My lighter won't work. Oh. Now it's all dark. You think you're funny? I don't think so. Better come out. Show me those hands. Get out of my house. Get. Scram. Hey. Get. Scram. This is my home. My home. Hey, that's my room. Yeah, I see you. You think you're funny? I'm not scared of you. No way, Jose. Oh, a gun. Can I have it? Can I have that gun? It'd be nice. Can I have the gun? Aw, oh, man. Probably loaded. Oh, the radio. Hey, the door's open. I'm so happy. Today I took the pregnancy test and finally got pregnant. After so many years of treatment, John and me will finally have a baby. I haven't told him yet. I want to surprise him. I'm afraid of his reaction. He's making progress in his treatment, but he still has some flare-ups. Maya. Interesting. I keep hitting escape. And I'm trying to exit the note, but I, I keep forgetting it's Q. So I do apologize. The door open. Let's go. Look at these pictures. Oh. Hey, we can actually see outside a little bit. Hello. It's a nice, beautiful morning. Let's go ahead and open this door. Oh. I can't. Well. Can I have some keys or something? No? Aw, oh, man. Uh, oh. Oh. I might have missed that. Somebody spilt jelly on the floor. Jeez. Hey. The door's just door open. Eh. It's unfortunate the world we live in. People. The 
man suffered from split personality and had been released from the psychiatric hospital a few months ago. How bad can human be? It's unfortunate, the world we live in. People who don't value life. Today I bring terrible news. A man had a psychotic break and stabbed his wife to death. He took the fetus out of her belly and put it in the crib. She was three months pregnant. The man suffered from split personality and had been released from the psychiatric hospital a few months ago. How bad can human be? Jeez. What in the heck? It's unfortunate. That's crazy. Oh, man. Well, I guess I'm the split personality person? Or that would make kind of sense. <sighs> What the heck? What are you doing in my home? Oh, that's the woman I killed. Yeah, because it has the pistol. It obviously makes sense. He's, yeah. That would make sense. Let's get this over with. This is, I guess, what you would see in multi-personality or something. It's got to be like, I'm him and something... I understand. I get it. You're gonna be over here. It was a peaceful day, and now it's just... Ugh, oh, jeez. Now it's just horrible. Oh my. Hey, they don't even have that thing up there. It's like, uh... On the PT, they had the, um... The top. They had, like, the little barricade, like, upper stairs. Now it's just a room. Oh, hello. You want me to come in there? I can, I can go in here if you want. Yes? Oh. You don't want me to go in there? You want me to go back there? Maybe? Well, you want you want me to come in here? Okay. Or do you want me to over here? Either way, I'm just looking. This is my home too. Let me alone. Leave me alone. It's my home too. Fine, I'll go down here. Can I open the door? I'm back over here. Hey, there's no pistol. Hmm. Weird. Why would there be no pistol? Alright, I'm walking in here. Just leave me alone. I can't get in this room. Oh. Is it on here? Hey! This is my home! This is my home too! I have a right to be here! I have a right to be here! You won't get me! I have a right to be here. Hey! Get out of here! Oh, jeez. Ugh. Oh, what a nightmare. People. Oh. Let me in here. Yeah, you think you're so funny. Oh. Well, let's play some games then. 
Come on. Tell me what your skin is. I'll be here. Waiting for you. You can laugh all you want. You don't scare me. Try me. I dare you. You don't scare me one bit. Not a bit. Go ahead. Turn off the lights. Oh, the bathroom. What's this? It's been two months since John got out of the hospital where we are very happy with Alice's arrival. I'm worried because sometimes he has outbreaks. Whenever this happens, I lock myself in the bathroom and Alice and me are safe here, Maya. Yeah. Well, I'm sorry. That's creepy. As long as you're safe in the bathroom, I guess. It's all good. I guess. You want to get me now? I'm trying to face my fears. Oh, phone. It's in the other room now. Oh, trying to lure me into the room, I see. Oh. What the heck? It is on the other side. You want me on the phone? Hello? Hello? Oh, it must be wrong number. Well, well, well. You have me here now. Might as well just come and face me. I'm in the bedroom. Or the bathroom. You gotta be somewhere. Hey, cockroach. Come on. Show yourself. Is you right on this wall? I'm at the window. Oh! You think you're so funny. Well. You're at the window. Interesting. Well, I'll just double check. Hey, let's go to the window then. Think you're so big and bad? <laughs> you think you're funny? of death. What the heck? It's a bunch of babies. You think you're funny? You think this is gonna scare me? Well, you have another thing coming. A bunch of babies on the walls. A bunch of babies on the wall. Hello. <laughs> Now the room's full of blood! Oh no! Ah, oh, jeez. We're in a blood room. I can't even open the door. Come on, out and play! Come on! Show yourself! Come on! I'm already suffered enough.
Come on! I already suffered enough. Just let me die. You think you're funny? Well... Blood dripping from the walls. I can't see. I can't see. I don't have a light. Hello? Might as well walk down here. Better safe. Hopefully. I'll walk back to the chair. Okay, I'm back here. Now what? I can't open that. The lights are just flickering. Locked doors. How do I get out of this massacre? I can't see. <sighs> oh, okay. Jeez. Holy macaroni. I say macaroni because holy hell. When does it end? Is the room normal again? Ugh, man. This has been a, a nightmare. Alright, the cockroaches is still here. Let's go see who else is here. Gonna be scary. Still a letter here. Oh, it's the same letter. Hello? Hello? Probably no one home. Anybody in the window? No? Hello? Can I go out now? No? You're not even gonna let me leave? Something's flashing over here. Hey! Oh. Bathroom's all full of blood. Same letters, though. Alright. I see... The danger I've caused. I understand now. What do you want me to do? Nothing's opening except these the bedroom and the bathroom. Let me see if there's anything. I understand. I understand. <laughs> That was interesting. That's some creepy shit. Jeez. What the heck? Oh. Where are we at now? Oh. Well, there's the woman that was murdered. Baby in the crib. It's unfortunate, the world we live in. People who don't value life. Today I bring terrible news. A man had a psychotic break and stabbed his wife to death. He took the fetus out of her belly and put it in the crib. She was three months pregnant. The man suffered from split personality and had been released from the psychiatric hospital a few months ago. How bad can human be? Wow. 
That was kind of crazy though. I mean, that was really scary, really crazy. I, it was very done well. Yeah, that was that was pretty awesome. That, that was that was good. I guess. Um, well. That's it for this video. If you liked it, like it, subscribe for more, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.